Hello folks, welcome back to another one. Welcome to a new video. I have my two assistants here with me. My assistant, I'm the assistant, let's be honest. <laughs> <laughs> Today we are just gonna, this is kind of mix and match sort of uh, video. As you can see, it's been very snowy. We've got lots of snow. So I've done a bit of snow plowing. I'll chuck a little bit of that in. Um, and we're just gonna move some sheep now. We, all the ones that had the snow blindness, we're gonna move back together correct? Yeah, so we'll forecast quite a bit more snow. All the guys that we treated for the snow blindness are looking a lot better and it's cleared up so we're gonna move them all back together and up the hill and there's just they have access to the wood so there's a lot more shelter for them up there and we've also got a ring with bales in it for them so they have plenty of roughage when they can't reach the the snow because of the the grass <laughs> the grass because of the snow covering um and then we'll just feed them all together in so we'll have two lots we'll have um lot one and then lot two on the other half of the farm yeah. um so yeah. <laughs> that's the plan anyway hopefully some nice drone shots and yeah <clears throat> let's get to it hey Paul.
That's all the sheep moved. Oh yeah, Sue's getting the quad. Because we had a bit of wind as well, it's been quite windy while it's been snowing, it's drifted quite a bit. So it's, I mean, well over, well over the ankles. Halfway up my shins, actually. You gotta love the snow. But yeah, so we're giving them this bit as well. Um, so they can get a drink. This is what we call the well in here. Because there's a, a wee burn at the back there. Um, and we'll put a bell ring in here for them so they can get some food. We'll do that later. up the bale ring and then we're going to put a bale in for both flocks of sheep because now so we had four flocks we had them split into four groups and now we only have two groups which made the feeding much easier and then so we're going to put a bale out to each group of sheep and um, yesterday my dad put out a bale to the tucks and the hogs so they're all sorted as well and obviously the cows are getting bales every day so yeah a lot of snow, so the, um, it means that the animals are getting, we're going through the bales quite quickly because obviously they can eat the grass and they need fed. So, yeah. Yeah. I'll just say as well, probably one of the reasons it's in such shite condition is because we're carrying it like that with the, the forks. It's actually better to carry it with strops. Um, yeah, but. Can we get a close up on this? Look at this. I'm not gonna, I'm gonna make it work. Funny how it's about that much of a bit metal holding it together. Yeah, my it was really funny one time my dad was carrying it like that and then he rolled it all the way down the hill accidentally. Um so maybe it was like one of the ones that dad's rolled. Well, I had to quickly just show you the drifts that we've been getting. I mean that is that's deep. See if I jump in it. Rosie's leaving without me. That's pretty deep. About waist height, roughly. But again, we haven't actually had that much snowfall. It's just, just the drifting. It's cool though. Anyway, anyway, anyway. Playing around aside, back on with a video and moving this bale, bale ring. Don't want to get out of the tractor, go away. Because I'm the best driver and I'm doing She's that. very cold. I'm letting all the cold air in as well. Means I'm on gate duty. Gate duty and filming duty. Here's the bale we put here earlier. Like a blue pizza. Here's one I made earlier. They're interested. Oh, lovely. So yeah, it's an old feeder, but still does the trick. Happy days. There we go. If you can see that. They found the bale and they're tucking it into it. The last bale. Oh, I don't know, this one's, this bale feed is not much better actually. <laughs> yeah. yeah, so this ring feeder is equally in a bit of a state. Nailed it! <laughs> there you go. 
There you go, ladies. Enjoy. We've had more snow. So I'm just going to make this quick. All done. Oh, well, basically, I went around before and I clicked like that, right, before I ploughed it. But then I'll cut it to be clicking again and it will be ploughed. So I'll go, oh. so it'll be, like, it'll be like that and it's done. So it'll look good in the video. Okay. Oh, hey. Hey, So who's this? Because we actually don't do much about the horses, do we? So this is Hambo. This is my pony and I've had him since I was nine. He is 34 now. He's my partner in crime since 2K9. But yeah, he looks great. Um, obviously he's got his big winter coat at the moment, but he was a um, driving pony. He was one of the Duke of Edinburgh's driving ponies. And then when he retired, um, we were very lucky to get him. Um, I can't take him on proper rides anymore, but I can um, like still just jump on him on the field and plod about in the fields and stuff with him. And then that is Theon, who is my mum's Highland pony. So this is a fell pony, yeah? Yeah, fell pony. This one's quite nice. I need my lunch, I think. <laughs> <laughs> Hopefully not the horse. <laughs> 34 and look at that bottom. He looks great for his age. Oh, he's got snowballs in his feet. Oops, the ice gets all balled up. and Because he's got really big feathers. Feathers. I can never say this. Oh, sorry, Hamby. Anyway, that is us for the video. Um, a bit of a kind of here, there and everywhere sort of video, you know. A bit of snow ploughing, a bit of moving sheep, a little bit of the horses at the end as well, you know. Um, but it's just the kind of what we get up to when it's really snowy. Or this is just kind of like what we get up to. Well, apart from the snow ploughing, like yeah, putting out bonus. bales <laughs> and feeding and doing horses and stuff. Is yeah. And that's I guess normally as well we'd often have two groups of sheep on either side of the farm, but because of the snow blindness we had four and we moved them back together. So, yeah. Anyway, thanks for watching. We'll see you on another one. Bye-bye. Bye. Bye. <laughs> Bye.